On June 17, 2018, one of the tops broke off of one of my trees, a big 100-foot ponderosa pine. It did a somersault and landed on my neighbor's deck. On August 1st, I had a crew come out and take down the tree. The main top was cut and came crashing to the ground. The second top was cut and let down with a rope so it did not damage the fence. Then the trunk of the tree was cut into bite-sized pieces. They came crashing down into the pile of limbs below. The bottom 12-foot piece was cut and guided to a controlled landing on the same pile. The guys chunked up the larger pieces and stacked them on the blacktop. The tree was big. It measured 36 inches across the widest spot on the bottom piece. That section was flared out a little from the main trunk. The next section up was not flared and measured 27 inches across. I counted the rings on that piece and found it to be 114 years old. Counting from the inside out, the rings were narrow until 1987. What happened that year? The house was built, and the yard started getting regular water. That's when the tree growth really took off. To put it in perspective, I placed my claw hammer on its surface to get a sense of scale. That's the story of this grand old tree. After 114 years, its triple top became a problem when one of them broke. At that point, the tree became dangerous and had to come down. <laughs>